We are in booming Burnaby, the third largest municipality in British Columbia, one of the most diverse areas of BC in terms of population, and one where an increasing number of people are living in apartments. Now, four years ago, that became a big election issue, primarily because of apartments in this area in Metro Town, older ones being torn down for taller ones, but the residents in the old apartments not being given protections for when they're dem evicted. That led to a shocking result. Mayor Derek Corrigan, in power for decades, losing to Mike Hurley, who had no political experience whatsoever. Now, four years later, there's no one challenging Hurley at this point. And a big reason why, says Hurley, is his collegial attitude around the council table. Well, I think I've been able to work with everyone, and that's, that's kind, of, um, it's kind of how I operate. I, I try to include everyone in all the decisions. You know, we don't agree on everything, but we uh, certainly are, seem to be able to work through most things. It's why neither of the two political parties at the council table say they will put a candidate against Hurley. Of course, there could be people outside of the council table that want to run against him. There's issues of affordability and safety in Burnaby, just like the rest of Metro Vancouver. But most of the time in this municipality, the election for mayor is not really competitive. It may prove that way again in 2022. Justin McElroy, CBC News, Burnaby.